Yeah. I remember he was throwing them. I know, I'm just saying it. Right there, go get on the ice box. I can't. There's no there's water. A, there's a gap in the fridge. That is the great papyrus. No, certainly. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover. The admirations for uh, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills. Is he about to tell me he loves me? The desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your boyfriend. No, no, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Dream, powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Oh. Papyrus blocks the way. What? F Flare James? So you finally reveal your <laughs> ultimate feeling. <laughs> well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. <laughs> I have zero redeeming qualities. <laughs> Oh no, that's humility. It reminds me of myself. You're meeting all my standards. <laughs> Let's date later, after I capture you. Kinky. Papyrus is thinking about what to wear. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Let's date later, after I capture you. So you won't fight? Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Yep. That would be very intense if it wasn't blue. Oh! Wait, what happened? You're blue now. See that? That's my attack. <laughs> <laughs> You're blue now. Hmm, I wonder. This one is called blue. So what does this mean? Um, I had to stay on the ground. Oh, okay. Papyrus stabs marinara sauce behind his ears. What? what? I'm not thinking about our date. See, it sinks me back to the ground and I have to jump yeah, over. over the okay. I have to jump the bone. Okay. I have to jump the bone. Papyrus stabs MTT brand oh, Bishy yeah. Cream behind his ear. What is Bishy Cream? I, I will Google that. Oh, not longer. To jump higher. Jeez. Papyrus stabs MTT brand anime powder behind his ear. Yeah. Don't make me open oh, this backwards. Okay. Papyrus stabs MPT brand cute juice behind his ear. I can almost taste victory. That's probably what he said. And spaghetti. That was that was mean. Papyrus stabs MPT brand attraction flying behind his ear. Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard. What year? <laughs> That's a good question. <laughs> beauty yogurt. <laughs> mm, I like this to beauty. Unparalleled spaghetti. Oh. Undyne would be so proud. I'm assuming that's. I'm just assuming at this point. Wow. I suck. <laughs> Smells like bones.
You reach one half of the bicycle. Your HQ is not fast. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. Yeah! <laughs> Wait, what is the hair just saying? The hair is just saying, yeah. Just yeah. <laughs> My brother, well, well, he won't change very much. <laughs> the pirates is preparing a bone attack. Uh -oh. I have lots of my mirrors, <laughs> but... Giggity! Gig, gig, gig! Oh, oh, yeah. The pirates is cackling. Will anyone like me? That went well. <laughs> it, it, well. It's not going well at all. It's stuck. It's another thing called shark. No, you're going to have shark. a hard time on this one. Shut up. The pirates is trying hard to play it cool. Someone like you. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. It's a unicycle. It's called a unicycle. <laughs> and dating might be kind of hard. <laughs> After you... I, I should start reading those. Yeah. Oh, I suck. The pirate is considering it. Who cares? Give up! Papyrus is rattling his bones. Give up or face my special attack. Why are you kind of giving him giving the thing like the accent like the dude that's always narrating the like National Geographic stuff? As you can see, there is a wild tiger in its natural habitat. I'm going to go poke it with a stick. <laughs> that reminds me of a, a vine. You eat one half the bicycle and recover 11 HP. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. I like this. When I play it, every time it highlights something red, I always do it in like a deep voice like, Super good attack. Papyrus is cackling. I eat one half the bicycle. I'm Toria. Can you take over? Hello, I'm Toria. Sorry, I'm sorry. You tried to trick me. This is your last chance before my special attack! Yeah! <laughs> Papyrus is cackling. Behold! My special attack! Jenna? What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey! What are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. I'll, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. The pirate is getting ready for a regular attack. Bye. Here's just a normal, here's a regular attack. Ow. Ow! Hey! Hey! Chill! Chill! That is not regular by any means! They're dancing! <laughs> what the heck is the special going to be? <laughs> <laughs> cool. Dude! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh. Wait, what? I didn't keep jumping. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even get out of the box! Eh, I want to get hit by it so bad. You're gonna die. You only have two left. Well, huh, it's clear you can't. Defeat me. Yeah. I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now your chance to accept my mercy. Sure. Hello. <laughs> That's new. <laughs> <laughs> you math.
It <laughs> won't do you a bit of good to review math. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. Another join the Royal Guard. My friend's quantity will remain stagnant. What a loser. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowee! We haven't even had our first date! Uh oh. <laughs> and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to get people off of puzzles and then fight them? <laughs> It's the best way to make friends. I gotta use that technique. You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you direction to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cave. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. <laughs> the magically seal trapping us all on the ground. <laughs> Except someone with a powerful soul, like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. <laughs> the king of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. <laughs> Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamboot. Can't spy, can't spy, please, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by, to come by and have that date. Now you have a date. Congratulations. Wait, what? I'm gonna go on, I'm gonna go on that date. Be right back. So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll, I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Okay. I swear if he goes back to his house. <laughs> My house! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Welcome to Scenic, my house. Enjoy your time. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. So, inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. Inside that quantum physics book was another joke book. Inside the joke book was another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> Ooh, it's my favorite game show! It says, stay tuned for a new program, MPT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me! Okay. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans! Please pick up your stock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. <laughs> you moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? <laughs> Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. <laughs> you touch the couch. The it makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20 G. I didn't know I can go in the kitchen. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quickie. Peach. I know. <laughs> but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd! So, high? Impressed? I increased the height of my... Shelf! Is that what that says? <laughs> I'm guessing so. I have no idea. 
Be right back. Sink? Sink? Oh, sink. sink. Now, if I can fit more bones under it. <laughs> what? Catch that meddling canine! Curses! <laughs> Sands! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we can go in and do whatever people do when they date. Um, <laughs> Alright. Um, Alright. Okay. No. No, yes. Not yet. Okay. Oh, yeah. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. The door is locked. Can I ever go in here? Eventually. Okay. I don't know, I don't know how, but you can. You can get the key from sand. Hey, those are all attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. It wasn't even though it would basically <laughs> just happened. <laughs> the internet is quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double digits follower count. So you have negative two followers? No, he has three. Oh, wait, yeah, he has three. He's just a dozen away three. from a double digit follower count. Either he can't count, or. <laughs> he has negative one. He has negative two. Yeah, because Kevin is a negative one. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Always says to be bad puns in a goofy font. Is that font? I, I, Comic I Sans! Sense. The computer's in an F browser. It's open to a social media site. Really and there are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. Those are how not neatly inside. The books. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. The next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Isn't that flag Nito? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a school, have a cool skeleton on it? Have I have a theory. Skeleton. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Yeah! I said backwards. Yes, action figures. Great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. Uh, do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Santa! Action figures of my sexy robot. Well, then! <laughs> That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, stuff on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. This might be a little bit more plausible if you can stop on your skin. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Okay, dating start. What? Here we are, on our date. I'm getting really tired of this stupid voice. <laughs> I've actually never done this before. I know the feeling. But, but don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time! Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on the day on the keyboard for the dating hut. Whoa. Wowee! I feel so informed! I think we're ready for step two. I'm pretty sure that is not the dating hut. Population crime what? Ask them on a date. Ahem! Human, I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Why is there an egg? Really? Wowie! <laughs> Facebook. 
I guess that means it's time for part three. The food. Put on nice clothes or so you can. Oh, wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No. Could it be? You wanted to date me from the very <laughs> beginning. Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> no. You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. No, your dating power. What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Don't think you bested me yet. I, the great papyrus, have never been beaten at dating. And I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I, too, can wear clothing. <laughs> In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Yeah, what do you think about my style? No, a genuine compliment. Uh-oh. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid! This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. What you do? <laughs> There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. Human souls are stronger than monster souls, but the souls of our sho shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. <laughs> Holding my hand, so I'll tell you the answer. <laughs> no, I must resist. I see, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. <laughs> but who doesn't? This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip. All clothing articles can be improved this way. My hat? My hat? My hat? Yeah! <laughs> Well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. And it's spaghetti. Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right? But oh, so wrong. This isn't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti, finely aged in milk and cast. What? Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. You take a small bite. Your face reflectively scrunches up. Aww. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus, I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great pup. Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before, and instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper, deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. 
and act like, oh, this never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. Fair point. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for a second best. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime, platonically. <laughs> well, gotta go. <laughs> so, uh, that just happened. I'm gonna go find a safe point. I think it's back at the beginning of the village. So, uh, I'm gonna go save this. Yes! There's where I can save it! The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Okay, and with that, I'm done for the day. That was, uh, I don't think I've ever experienced anything weirder in a video game. I've dated a skeleton. Anywho, um, my voice is getting really tired from doing all those, and you know you can probably notice towards the end there it started to go, so, uh, I think it's best if I just quit there. So, uh, in the next video, I guess we'll just... I don't know how much of that I actually recorded before Bandicab stopped recording. So I'll just restart. So, uh, my voice is pretty much done. Uh, uh my fellow Americans. <laughs> Anyway, my, my voice is pretty much done from doing papyruses for so long, uh, that was pretty much the weirdest thing I've ever experienced, and, uh, in the next video we'll just kind of continue. But until then, you guys just enjoy yourselves, and I will see you in the next one, alright? Bye!